What is up guys? It is Farzi here and today I am going to teach you guys how to make a fog effect in vanilla Minecraft and all you need is some gray glass or rather light gray glass but it can be any color you want but here's how light gray glass looks for the fog as you can see it's very good there are some lines that make it look a little weird from a distance Wow, it really looks like a foggy effect, it's great. Now let me do a little disclaimer. If you wanna get rid of these lines, you can install Optifine. They have a feature called, I think it's connected textures and it takes away these lines. So if you don't like these that much, go install Optifine. But this video is gonna be a vanilla tutorial. So if you're playing in vanilla, the lines will be there. But anyways, you can use other colors. Light gray works the best for the fog. It can be like red for like a like an evil looking thing or like purple for like a midnight blue kind of fog. Do what you want, be creative. But anyways, here's how you do it. Let's pretend this is the hole I want to make foggy. Now first off, we're gonna do a layer of glass the size of the hole, one below the surface. So not here, but one below the surface. And this is because if you put glass up here and you can walk over the fog, it looks really dumb. It looks better when it's one down and the fog looks like it's starting lower. So start here. Now we're gonna fill under it every other. Now let me explain why. Over here, this is the wrong way, this is the right way. If you do every other, there's a foggy effect. If you do one solid block of it, you can see right through it. And that's because the game recognizes when glass is on top of glass and it says, hey, this is one big glass block. But when you put these spaces here, the game can't recognize that it's both glass and it won't make everything transparent. So boom, foggy effect, no foggy effect. So using that method, go back to your hole, now go under that and do layers with spaces. So like this, do glass, space, glass, space. Now I'd say at least do about five, six, maybe even seven of these glass layers because if you only do a couple, you can see down too easily. So keep going down and keep doing layers until you like how it looks. And that's how it looks when you're done. I probably could have done a few more layers, but this is just a little test for you so you see how it looks. It looks much better with bigger area space like this, but again, just a test. But anyways, now you can do different colors like I mentioned, so now let's try it with purple. Now that looks super cool, looks kind of like a Halloween themed fog, I would use that definitely for a Halloween build. Now let's try something a little bit more evil looking, like, like red. Oh, that one looks super cool. Maybe not the best for fog, but still looks very, very awesome for like an evil, like lair kind of a thing. But anyways, guys, let me once again remind you, definitely do this on a bigger area space, like a cave of this size or bigger. These small holes don't look the greatest as you can see, but when you get bigger, it looks so much better. And the final thing I'm gonna say is once again, if you don't like those lines inside your cave, just uninstall, or rather install, not uninstall, install Optifine and turn on connected textures. Now that's going to be it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you make a cool build, let me know. I want to hear about it. I want to see it. But once again, on that note, make sure to like, subscribe, do all the good stuff, and I'll talk to you guys next time. So until then, goodbye.